Good morning, North Town. I'm Abram Hoff. I'm Cindy Kelly. Today is Tuesday, January 6th, and we are broadcasting to you from Studio 217. This is NTV News. Be sure to follow us on Twitter at North Town News, subscribe to our YouTube channel, NTV News at NKCHS, and check out our Facebook page, NKC Journalism. Stay up to date with everything North Town. We also have our Instagram, NKC Pride. Today is the official start of second semester with your A-Day classes. Remember that you need to keep 90% attendance or above in all your classes in order to not have your grades lowered at the end of the semester. We want to find out what you did over winter break. Hope you had a restful time and are recharged for the new semester. The only thing I did over winter break, probably clocking in over 40 hours each week. Making money's good. Practically throwing a snowball at all my friends. Then next thing you know, I have multiple friends come over. We have big snowball fights. That was glorious. Well, besides all the usual presents I got, which was awesome, I went to several different relatives' house. I went out of town. I ate some chicken. I came back into town. I ate some more chicken. That would have to be the Glass Animals concert. It was amazing. Sleep and watch Netflix. North Town Seniors, there will be a student panel on Wednesday, January 7th in the hospitality room during advisory. Wednesday grads will be there to answer any questions that you might have as well as share their freshman year experience. The sophomore class ring meeting is tomorrow during advisory. All sophomores who attend will not have a travel day. There will be a brief meeting after school on May 211 for all students going to the Missouri Thespian Conference. There will be a tech crew meeting for all students working in Little Shop of Horrors today at 315 and Main 217. The next A plus tutor training is Wednesday, January 14th during the during advisory in the lower level of the Library Media Center. You can get a pass to attend from your advisory teacher or Miss McQuarrie in the Student Service Center. With the start of the new year, many of you may be making resolutions, but we also want you to focus on setting goals and achieving them. As we welcome 2015, instead of New Year's resolutions, how about New Year, New Goals? School. How were your grades from last semester? Did they at least improve from last year? If not, maybe you can focus on being better prepared and strengthen your lack of focus. And if you're really struggling with the class, call in a tutor. That way you can start strong and finish the same way. Then when talking about school, maybe you wanted to play a sport last semester, but didn't feel pushed enough to do it. So why not start now? It's a brand new year. What's holding you back? Hmm? Exactly, nothing. And if you're not the athletic type, maybe it's time you join a club. Here in Northtown, there are many groups, teams, and clubs to join. Home life. So as teens, we seem to be a little less social with parents, mostly because we view things from different perspectives. But well, maybe it's time we hear what our parents have to say. They could have some good advice for us. Or maybe you could set a goal to help out more around the house, wash some dishes, fold some clothes, eat a little less, you know, save some food for everybody else. When it's a goal, it's just an achievement waiting to happen. Mindset. So the few things I went over today all stem from the same root which is the same root that all change, improvement, and motivation comes from, which is your mindset. Whether you set your mind to something negative or positive, you are more likely to achieve it. Why? Because you have the best motivation that you can ever get, and that's the motivation that comes from within. So whether it's a sport, getting active, eating less, eating more, eating better, trying to get a job, trying to save money, just remember, you can do it all if you have the right mindset. So set some goals for yourself and stay self-motivated. And when people underestimate you, that's the best time to show them up. Have any topics I missed that you think should be shared? Come find me and let me know. I'll make a continuation of this video just for you. In sports today, we have Varsity JV Boys Basketball at Raytown at 5.30 p.m. and Varsity JV Wrestling at Blue Springs South grand view at 5 o'clock p.m. Thanks for watching, Northtown.
Have a great day and keep it classy. And Happy New Year.